Do you mind if I film this event as yes. part of my election night yes. blogging? Yes. All right, it's election hold on, night. Hold on, hold on. Is, well, is, are you vlogging yet? Yes. Oh, is it live? Not live. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. You can if you want to. Yeah, my dad said he would be here at 710 to pick me up to take me out to vote. Really? Yeah, and I... I think he said we'll go to Bill Gray's. Oh, hard, hard. Eat. Don't need money. I want you to do the video. Yeah, I'll keep You guys free on Saturday, 1034? Oh, gosh, we forgot about that. that. You free? Do you want to reach over on Saturday? Yes. I have one more opening. Oh, uh, shit. Actually, I'll leave. What time? I just can't make a commitment for that long. You're free on Saturday? Um, I'm not, but I guess. Christina? So, uh, what ice cream flavors are there? Vanilla? Apple pie. Frozen yogurt, vanilla, Neapolitan, and then raspberry sorbet for dairy-free people. So we're going to keep that like hidden and have a sign that says dairy-free option available. Are you going to come through the program too? Maybe the program is having to study. They can have ice cream. Okay. All right. Oh, the ice cream? No, eat. Get ahead of your phone. I'm assuming that the first polls have already closed. I think the, according to what I've read, the first polls. Yeah, that's good. They should probably be open later. Do you think so? This is a great yeah, program. I know. Yeah. Ice cream's right here. Wait, so which program officially is this? Residence Council Program. Mm hmm. Uh, did you get eggnog? No. Oh, isn't that generally regarded as a winter drink? It's not winter yet. Yeah. Hmm. Figured. Uh, so I'm planning for planning on voting for us uh, voting a straight democratic line. Yeah, that's cool. I'm hoping uh, the Democrats retake both the House and the Senate. Mm -hmm. sure, yeah. Preferably by as much as possible. Yep. Sing it, E. Damn hell. Ooh, that was beautiful. That was not even the right word. That was so scary. Oh, wow. Wow. 
According to uh, research I've done, um, the Democrats can get up to 60 seats in the Senate. Can get up to up to controlling 60 seats in the Senate. And as for the House, hmm. Well, technically, isn't all of the House up for re-election? So technically, theor in theory, the Democrats could win every single seat in the House. Yeah. Wouldn't that be a mate? Well. When, well, then again, there would be no representation for. In theory, though, the Democrats could win every seat in the House. And that would be incredible if it did happen. But all that's really needed is to take control of the House and the Senate. Great. Thanks for helping me out. Yeah, did, they, did the people like it? Yeah, they loved it. Oh, we loved the did the people like it? <laughs> people loved it. They were like, wait, Mila and uh, isn't it? And I'm like, yeah. Excuse no, I mean, me. I was going to call me Lauren earlier. Cool. I was going to call you Lauren. Yeah, who's Lauren? You, you should have said that. Who's Lauren? <laughs> that would be funny. Excuse me, uh, what time is it? It's 6.55. 6 6.55? I'm going to go around to 7, so I'll be back after rounds. I mean, you kind of are, but like, it's fine. We should talk about it. It's fine. It's fine. We'll talk about it. <laughs> we'll just dismiss it. It's fine. Here's, here's what the problem. Here's where we are. <laughs> you are such a good. I love it. I do that all the time. Yeah, you do. I mean, like, you completely abandoned us, but, you know, it's... Mm, which of I these go all the time. I'm really good at it, too. Which of yeah. these flavors do you think Dad would like? I don't know. Hmm. Oh my god. He needs someone to stop update him. you. Honestly, you. if you're going to keep something, you can, I you you can it was just Christmas, like, 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 you know, like. Yeah, but it wasn't. Like, you gotta I mean, say the right words. Well, well, the words. Did what did you just matter? say? You didn't even say the right thing. Yeah, there weren't even the right lyrics. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so but like, 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 bilingual! E. Respect me. Sing it how you do. Respect me. Respect me. We do respect you. Sing it in a different language. I'm so afraid. Are the butternutter cookies for that everyone? No, this is just that's yeah, that's so Sorry, man. Oh, that's okay. Oh I was God, just I asking. Just say, just say one like line. Okay, well, give me a line from. Oh, okay. Uh, baby, please come home. 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 Uh, baby, please come home. Uh, so baby, you say baby. Okay, so. Baby, 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 Wait, so what language was that? Is this our RC meeting for tonight? All right. This is my Sunday. And it's going to be coming with rainbow sprinkles. Go Dem! Rainbow Sprinkles for LGBTQ plus rights. And the Neapolitan represents both racial equality and LGBTQ plus rights. Work smarter, not harder. Do you want ice cream? I could just use it. I could just use it. That would be a wise idea. It's good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. What time of course. Did you there you go. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. You're good. Thanks. No problem, Tyler. Do you want ice cream? Sure. Oh, 
Hmm. The whipped cream and rainbow sprinkles are pretty good. And the ice cream tastes pretty good too. Do all that? Mm, yeah. You know the address is 700 Island Cottage Road, right? Right. Okay. I. I recycled my bowl and spoon. Yeah. Yeah. What bowl and spoon from? Uh, from an event for the election night. But what was it? A bowl and spoon. What was it? <laughs> for ice cream sundays. But was it a good bowl and spoon? Yeah. Why? Beca because um, because the bowl was made out of styrofoam and the spoon was made out of plastic. Oh, it wasn't like a good bowl and spoon, but you said it was a good bowl and spoon. Oh, I thought you meant the quality of the bowl. I didn't know you were referring to basically a real bowl and spoon. Yeah, I thought it was... Uh, this uh, this was my RC held in a an event to celebrate the election night. Uh, this is channel ninety seven point nine, station ninety seven point nine. You're gonna vote. You're gonna uh, video all this. Yeah, I was planning on vlogging. Can you can you videotape it? Uh, I, don't I don't think, think so. Gonna, I don't think you're going to be able to bring that in. But don't worry, I won't need to. Huh? Don't worry, I won't need to. Uh, people aren't going to want to have you vote, film them while they're voting. <laughs> right. Yeah. Thanks so much for taking me out to vote, Dad. You're welcome. Democrat, right? Yep. I'm going to be a registered Democrat forever. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what, Tyler? What? With Trump in office, we really haven't heard much about ISIS, right? What do you mean? Exactly, right? I haven't heard anything about them attacking or doing anything. In a long, long, long time, right? Or have you? I haven't really bothered to look much. Yeah, but I, I'm just saying. That's one good thing that he's done, right? Trying to protect the world? Um, or no? It isn't necessarily the United States that did that. There's evidence to suggest that Russia did. Russia played a bigger part in that. Oh, really? oh, okay. I mean, it, it's not just the United States. Just about every country participated in that. Oh, okay. um, Israel, well, yeah, the European big three countries. Or whatever they're called. Yeah. Okay. It's not just the United States. The United States is not the only country in the world. Well, well, I understand that. But I'm just saying, I, what, I haven't heard anything about it. But when Morocco was in it, it was all, you know, ISIS, 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 ISIS. You know? But that's my two cents. Okay. Hmm. Perhaps, perhaps maybe one theory. Yeah. But it is true that. Hmm. Well, let me think. Um. Well, a lot of crazy stuff has been going on. And besides, modern-day terrorism has been a serious problem all this time. Mm -hmm. It does 
it should be a, it should be addressed, but it should be addressed in a peaceful and compassionate way, because you know violence will only bring more violence, right? Well, true, but you really can't say, "Hey, come on over and have some pancakes and tea," when they got guns and throwing them at you, bullets and stuff, right? <laughs> right? That's only isn't that generally only because of because of the circumstances I mean it's not like it's not like uh, you just wake up and decide one day that you're going to bomb a train or something yeah, well, you gotta plan it out right yeah so you wouldn't just do it for lols or something you would do it for some other purpose uh, cause and effect right mm, perhaps but a lot of crazy things have been happening over this yeah. time. There was uh, the Muslim ban, the hearings between Ford and Kachevik, and also um, there were the recent terrorist attacks, those mail bombings, oh, not oh, to mention yeah. the shooting at that synagogue, the Tree of Life synagogue. Yeah, those have been in yeah, true. Yeah, that was an idiot, right? Yeah, the current president, right? Wow. Well, well, whoever did it was an idiot. And not to mention the tariffs. And then there was that policy of separating migrant children from their mm. families. Mm. And then... Yeah, that's hard not right at all. And then there was that tax scam. Though I don't uh, though I don't think I'm listing everything in order. Right. And that's probably because it's hard enough to list them at all when you close already. What place? Uh Shaler's right there or whatever that burger place that we went to one time. It's a possibility. It's closed. I mean, I can't access the news right away. Can't access previous news articles because I'm currently filming. There's all those many controversial tweets. Yeah. I don't know. He does does a lot of stupid things. Instead of being a president, he's got to put his two cents in. And he's got to play golf. <laughs> Not that it's inherently a bad thing, but why would you play so much golf? And then again, that political stunt over over the anthem protest. Everyone has fir First Amendment rights. Everyone has a right to free speech. Right. A right to uh, protest for racial equality. Again or no? uh, sure, I'm going to end the recording. Oh, you recorded that? <laughs> yeah. Thanks for taking me out to vote, by the way. I know. Just to show you how grateful I am. I know. You're uh, is there anything on your mind right now? Like what? Anything politically related? Uh -huh. Now is a great time to be talking politics. Well, I hope your people win, right? Me too. Would you say that the Democrats are 
a party for everyone? Why, the Republicans aren't? No, I don't think so, at least. They're just for themselves. Mm, yeah, I guess so. They and their rich donors. <sighs> I mean... Well, who did the Democrats get their money from? They gotta have some rich donors too, right? Look in the corner there. There's a bar in the corner right by that Ruby Gordon's. Back there. I, I don't know. I can't buy Bed Bath & Beyond back in the mall. I can't look because I'm driving. Oh. Were you thinking of going there? Well, I don't know if it's open. I don't even know what it is. No, not today. I'm just going to get food and go home. I mean, look what time it is. I've been on the run all day. 7.35. It's a good thing the polls are open until 9, although, to be honest, I think they should be open till later. Now they got to count them and all that, right? True. Hmm, do you know if... Hmm. <laughs> do you know if that... Ah, uh, Connor Lamb, yes. Do you know if Connor Lamb has won yet? Who's Connor Lamb? He was the Democratic candidate in that Pennsylvania House race. I have no idea. I, if I don't know who he is, I have no idea. Oh, it's been so long since that that race went into a, a recount. Uh, and still I've heard nothing according to what I've what I've heard what I've looked up, what I've seen in the news perhaps maybe I should try to look up the results Don't you think it's kind of nuts how the president is sending the military over to the border? Uh, what, the Mexican border or the border? The U.S.-Mexican border. Yeah. yeah, I mean, these migrants are just people who are seeking a better life in the United States. Yeah. I mean, if you were invading a country, wouldn't you come in with... Wouldn't you come in with guns, bring them, bring that country's military in to our country? Wouldn't if you're invading a country, wouldn't yeah, you traditionally coming in peacefully, right? Well, I guess he wants to see who they are. And I don't. Know. Maybe they need more help. Border patrol's not good enough. But what can the military do? According to Vox articles I've read, they can't do much. Well, they can make sure everyone's peaceful, right? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't. You're into politics. I'm really not. I'd rather watch sports or something. Hmm. Everyone should be into politics as much as I am, in my opinion, because politics affects every aspect of our lives. You're right. That's, you know, an important part. We're almost there. All right. And besides, even Where if... Where are we, Tyler? You know? Ladder, ladder Road. And what is that? Cottage Street. Yeah, but... Where are we by? Bill Gray's. And besides, um, and which way would we have to go to get to Miles' house? Away from Bill Gray's. Right, but we got to go towards Bill Gray's. To get to Seven Hundred Island Cottage Road. Right. 
the single digits. Backdoor pass. Henry at the rim and another beautiful beat from Winston. Winston's got five assists. He has three turnovers. That's the only bad part so far of his game. I think it's right here. I don't have to build right here. But I'm not going to be able to see these. I'm not going to be able to. Do you remember any of it, Tommy? You know where we got to go? It's a retirement home. Alright, if you can see the addresses, the numbers, I can't see any numbers tonight. It's, it's too dark. Okay, I'll, I'll look, look out then. It's a retirement home. Yeah. I'm sure there's got to be a lot of people there. This is the school. Yeah, it's not there. Uh, what is that? Uh, I can't see. You can see the numbers. If you can see a number, then I can figure out how much. 190. 190? Yeah. Yeah, the caravan is not a threat to us. I mean... They don't. They don't seem to have any weapons at all. And What's this here? Could be that thing. What is that? Um. What's it? Did you see the address? No, I didn't see the number. I mean, could it be up here? Yeah, it could be. Uh, let me look. I don't remember exactly where it is. I mean, it, I'm not. Um, that looks like it's. Uh, I'm not Google Maps. Mm, yeah, yeah, that could be it. I think this is it. Yeah. Rochester <laughs> Regional. Uh, this game. This is 500 to 700 Island Cottage Road. All right. Yeah. It's got to be here then. Yeah. Which way? All right. That's 500. This must be 700. Yep. 600. That's 600. And Aaron Henry have to be Where's 700? Up, uh, straight up off the baseline. Will head to the free throw line. Shake off the That's 600. Wait, French Commons. Was it back here? Yeah. Do you even know? I see the building. Oh, that's it? Right. Yep, that should... Yep, that's it. All right, we're here. Guys, ready to vote. Woo-woo, Democrats! Yep. <laughs> you want me to go in there with you, or you want to go by yourself? Please go in with me if you want. Oh, no. I have no place to... What's this? Can I park right there? Yep. Can I? I guess. Oh, handicap. Oh, no, don't do that. All right, there's a spot. Good, good thing you saw that sign. It would have been awful if we had parked in that handicap spot. Even by accident. All right, be careful opening up the door. It's kind of tight. Oh, yeah, I remember something now. During the campaign, the current president m mocked a disabled journalist. Thanks. I am now a proud voter of a straight Democratic line. Yeah, I voted for all the Democrats. And what was the question? Yeah, I didn't know if there was a Democratic candidate for member of assembly, but there wasn't, so I just left that one blank. Because there is no way I am voting for a Republican. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What song is that? She's so high. Do you like that song? I'm so so sorry for what I did. I hope my stuff is still there. I hope so too. I'm I'm so sorry for leaving it in the lobby. <laughs> Why? What possessed you just to leave it there? I guess maybe because you said you were there and because you were going to take me out to vote and I guess go to Bill Gray's. Yeah, but Ty, you just can't leave. I, I mean, I wasn't there. I would have been like, Ty, you need to bring your stuff. I didn't know you had any of the stuff. 
Uh, you know? Uh, I hope it's all right. I'm really sorry. Yeah, well, time. You're the one who's going to be sorry. You're not going to have a computer to play with. Yeah, from now on, I'm going to bring my stuff. I mean, when I come and pick you up over the weekend, you bring everything. And then you really don't even use it when you bring it when you bring it all. Uh. You know? Oh, boy. Well, we got about another 10 minutes and we'll be there. Hey, yeah, I'm so sorry I didn't even think about copyright, but you can listen to your music if you want.